If you follow a cardio workout that doesn't have an extensive warm up, or you just want some light exercises to go towards your daily activity levels, then follow me on this six minute standing routine to get you going. Right, straight into this warm up then to get the heart rate going with a walk on the spot. So we're gonna start off gradually, build up slowly to allow your heart rate just to gradually build up over the next six minutes. So just a nice gentle walk to start off with. Make sure we're keeping good posture while we're walking. Tapping the ball of the foot down each time you step down and then get a little bit of a swing of the arms. Good. Okay, so from there we're gonna go into a side step. So we're just gonna tap one foot to the other as you tap from side to side. Side step in one way, side step back. And then we can use your arms a little bit, just bringing the arms round to the front and round to the side as you tap one foot to the other. Good. So let's add in a bit of a hamstring curl now. So as you side step, we're gonna lift the heel of one foot up towards your bottom. Good. And then we're gonna go into a box step next. So basically think of a square shape on the floor and we're gonna to step to each corner of that square. So we're gonna go forwards, forwards, back, back. Forwards, forwards, back, back. Okay, just to get your brains working, we'll switch that and lead with the opposite leg because you've probably been leading with one leg. So let's switch the opposite way around. Still going forwards, forwards, back, back. Good, okay, back into a walk again. While we're walking, we'll get the shoulders moving a bit with some shoulder shrugs. So lift both shoulders up towards your ears, squeeze the shoulder blades back together and then let the shoulders drop back down. So get as much movement as you can in those shoulders while we keep the feet moving. Really focus on squeezing the shoulder blades back together. Good. Okay, next one. We're gonna do a knee raise with a twist. So bring your hands out in front and you're gonna lift the knee straight up to the front as you then twist in the same direction. So if I lift my left knee, I'm twisting my torso to the left. As I lift my right knee, I'm twisting my torso to the right. So knees coming straight up to the front and then twist each way. Good. Last few seconds on this one. So now we're gonna change it to a knee raise, but this time to the side. So as we bring the knee out to the side, with the fingertips on the temple, we're just gonna side bend the torso, see if we can get the elbow to meet the knee. Depending on your mobility will depend on whether you do or not. So don't worry if you can't. Just bring it up as high as you feel comfortable. Good. Okay. Right, let's now go into a march. So a bit different to the walk. We're gonna lift the knees up a little bit higher and get more of a swing of the arms from the front to the back. Should be feeling your heart rates raised up a little bit now and you're breathing a bit faster. It's about halfway through the warm up. Right, let's go into do some heel digs with a bicep curl action on the arms. So as you dig the heel out to the front, we're bringing both fists up towards the shoulders, bending the elbows. Good. Keep the oxygen going in. Last few seconds on this one. And then we're gonna change it to a toe tap to the side. So as you do the toe tap out to the side and back to the middle, we're gonna do that with an arm raise. So you can raise your arms out to the side. You can raise your arms up to the front if you prefer, or on a bit of an angle. Give me a thumbs up as you do it. Good. So just find that tempo that works right for you. Keep that going. Last couple of seconds. And then we're gonna change it to a step back with the tricep kickback. So lift the elbows up, extend the arms to the back as you step back, pushing the ball of the foot into the floor behind you. At the same time as you do this tricep kickback with the arms. So don't let the elbows drop down here. Make sure we keep the elbows up nice and high all the time. And we're just straightening the elbows as you do that step back. 
Good. Last couple of seconds. Right there, next one. We're gonna step out to one side and we're gonna push the arms out to the front. So we're gonna pivot to change direction. So we're stepping back, push the arms forwards. Bring the feet together, step back, push the arms forwards. So we're getting that push. Good. So a little bit of rotational movement going on with this one. Last couple of seconds. Good, right, last one we're gonna do. Toe tap to the front. As we do that, we're gonna do that with the row movement with the arms. So imagine like you got hold of something, you're pulling it backwards at the same time as you do the toe tap to the front. If you can, keep your elbows up level with your shoulders. If your shoulders are feeling that, just drop the elbows down. So we're getting as much movement as you can, squeezing the shoulder blades back together. Good, well done. And then back into a walk again. So walk on the spot. Right, I hope you feel good, because that's your warm up complete. Now you've warmed up, you're ready for your workout or to enjoy the rest of your day. If it's helped you, then please give it a like by clicking the thumbs up button below and consider subscribing if you haven't already. You can also check out the description below for ways that you can help support this channel. But thank you so much for watching and until next time, stay active and keep moving to feel better. Eee.